We've done stories about how the Rochester City School District has full day pre-K, but that is the exception. Not every district has that. And that means picking a preschool for your child is a very important decision and one that you have to make because you have to go outside the district in order to find that. Yeah, and with us right now is Kathy Frame, uh, a teacher at Pittsburgh United Nursery School, uh, which has been around since how many years now? 1963? 1963. Wow, and you're here to talk about uh, parents choosing the right school and, and, and what parents need to consider when considering a preschool. And first and foremost, the value of preschool. Some parents say, what's the point? I'm going to send them to kindergarten anyway. Uh-uh, those, those years before kindergarten are essential. They are <clears throat> absolutely crucial, um, especially these days. We talked earlier about Common Core. Kids need a really solid foundation to be ready for the rigor of kindergarten these yeah. days. Um, I think parents are often surprised that January is the time to start looking for preschools. Hmm. Um, your child will be matriculating in September of 2015. So this is the time. Um, you need to be looking at things like educational philosophy, your own philosophy, your own parenting style. How does that fit with the mm. school uh, choice that you're going to be making now? Um, you need to look at things like school size, uh, teacher credentials, really important thing to look at. What is the experience of the teachers at the school that you're looking at? Um, class size, adult to student ratio in the classroom, both for ease of um, presenting the program for the teachers, but also safety and security for your child. Um, I always tell parents to think about what works for their whole family picture. Um, you know, is it proximity to your home and work? Is that important? Um, the, the times of the week, morning or afternoon, right. how often your child needs to be at school for your own personal situation. Is it, well. is it full day? It's not full day, right? Is Our school is not full day. Okay, so there, so there are half days. Yes, okay. absolutely. Morning and, and afternoon sessions, is that yes, kind of we, possible? Yes, we run two, three, and five day um, opportunities okay. for families. Are there full day preschools there out there? There are absolutely full day preschools out there. Um, some of them are kind of embedded in your more traditional daycare center, mm -hmm. which parents, if you're both working full time, you may need that option. Um, one of the great things about our area is that we, just like we have incredible um, higher educational institutions, we also have a lot of really great preschool options, mm -hmm. you know, from Montessori, Reggio Emilia, um, you've got a lot of private religious, private independent, and then cooperative preschools um, like Pittsburgh United Nursery School, which we call PUNS, mm -hmm. um, and that's a situation where parents are really actively engaged in their child's education. So mm -hmm. parents really need to know that if they in, you know enroll their child in the school that they're going to be called upon absolutely yeah. absolutely and one of the the beauties of puns is that um, you get to see firsthand your child's school experience you're working in the classroom about once a month so it's not a huge commitment um, in the classroom but it does give you that firsthand look a snapshot of what your child is like in school I don't know if you know this how does it compare the cost of daycare to preschool yeah, well, obviously daycare is going to be a pretty significant cost for families if you're talking about full-time daycare. Um, preschool programs at our school run anywhere from $900 a year up to as much as $2,500 a year if you're in a, a five-day-a-week program. You do find typically that um, cooperatives are slightly less expensive, and that's because of the parent-volunteer aspect. Hmm. Well, such great advice. And where can people learn more about you? So you can go to our website. Um, it's www.punsonline.com. And okay. we actually have our open house on Sunday, uh, January 11th, okay. coming up. That's and right, from 1 to 3. 1 to 3, exactly. Thank well, you thank so much. You. Yes.